next we're joined here in studio by James Kamau, who held activist and CEO of Kenya Treatment Access Movement. Thank you very much for joining us today. So Kenya has joined third largest epidemic in the world. That's alongside Mozambique and Uganda. Why is it seemingly lagging behi behind? Uh, thank you very much. I would not say Kenya is uh, lagging behind uh, at all in that sense. We do have uh, 1.3 million people who are on treatment, so we have gotten them. Yes, there are pockets and other areas where we have been trying to see uh, where to get them. And uh, there is a study that was done uh, recently, no, uh, Ken Fia, Kenya AIDS strategy, trying to get the number of people who are HIV positive. So it will come out, but we, those who need treatment are on treatment. Yes, I agree we have gaps uh, in the coverage, um, especially the identification of men, because that has been one of the biggest uh, problems, because uh, due to the stigma, men um, don't come out. Uh, then we have uh, the keep up, the keep ups, you know, the gay and lesbian community because of the stigma. You know, we have not yet been able uh, to capture them. And then, of course, we have the 15 and 24, which is also quite hard, you know, to be able to uh, to capture them. So I think one of the things we need to do is um, bring more uh, more change tack change the tactic of uh, how we approach this so that uh, it is not stigmatizing and people will come out. Okay, but we've seen several strides in the country. For instance, the home testing kits, we've got access to drugs such as PrEP. Um, what more do you feel could be done to fight this uh, pandemic? Uh, the self-testing kits are very good. First of all, uh, once you are tested, uh, self-testing, then you go for confirmatory. I think this is important uh, as we scale up uh, on this. Uh, the point here is now, the question is, the self-test kits were more readily available in private uh, uh, setups, uh, chemists and private hospitals. I think we need to roll it out into uh, the, the national sectors so that uh, people are more readily available. Okay. Yeah. All right, James. Thank you very much for that. James, come out in studio with us.